Yeah, that was one of the great things that in watching one of Jay Schaefer's videos, he said in going small, your world actually expands because then you're freed up in terms of um, time spent caring for the home and also money. Um, can you talk about have you had any sort of epiphanies in that area or has your life sort of freed up in some sense because you know, I know you're you're busy doing a documentary and you were making <laughs> so maybe now is it's premature to ask that, but at some point you feel like your world will definitely change because you won't have this huge um, liability on your back? Well, I mean, I feel like, you know, one thing with our story, which is, you know, becoming more part of the film as well, is that, you know, I think that we're still figuring out, you know, how the tiny house fits into our lives. And it's great that it's, it's given us the flexibility, you know, to, I mean, I'm from the East Coast and I've been thinking about going back to the East Coast to be closer to family and things like that. And so it's given us the flexibility to, you know, if I were to, to rent a small apartment, you know, on the East Coast, and then we can also have the tiny house in Colorado that is a base to come back to in Colorado. That's a place that we own, you know, we're not paying rent for. And I think it's given us um, more flexibility, you know, to kind of explore options and, and live in different places and have the kind of life that we want to live. Mm -hmm. and, and there's definitely a more of a sense of security when you own um, a house. And I, and I think anybody who's a homeowner probably experiences this when they, when they buy it, where, you know, you, especially when you own it outright and you don't owe the bank anything for it, but it's, it's like always a place that you can come back to. And, and so there's a sense like, Oh, if, if nothing else, if I lose my job or whatever, at least, you know, there's this place that I can go stay that I belong in. Um, so there's a certain amount of security that comes with that and, you know, sort of kind of opens doors in a way. Um, but as far as, uh, the Jay Schaefer quote, I, I think that also is sort of alluding to the this, the sense that when you live in in a sort of s smaller place and that takes less time to and uh, energy and emotion to think about that you have all that extra energy and time emotion to, to like sort of build your community or, or be out in the world um, and I think that you know that's definitely the case um, even in building the house you know we had a lot of our friends come and help out and, and then have come and, you know, and stayed up on the land with us and, and stuff. And it's been great at already at building community, but, um, you know, when we're up there too, we, we, you know, you're inside, but it's this, um, it's, it's, it's nice because the whole world really does kind of open up to you. And it's, it's kind of like building a home that almost feels more in the larger world in, in ways that a, a larger house mm -hmm. doesn't feel, you know, mm -hmm. I think also from a purely design perspective, I mean, just like the window to wall ratio is so much greater mm -hmm. in a tiny house that even though you're inside of a house, I mean, you have all of these windows. So just the presence of the natural world or the neighborhood or wherever you happen to be mm -hmm. is so much more a reality. Mm -hmm.